All right, so here's a quick setup of the uh, peel ply and whatever you want to call it. This is just spiral wrap you buy at the Home Depot store. You want to make sure the back side is protected, the uh, molds are flipped upside down, and you just tape it along the edge, and this provides a vacuum. I found that if you expose any of this black stuff to the bag, it can actually pop the bag. This is just blue painter's tape from Home Depot. So here was where it's exposed in the corners. I just want to protect the bag with a little piece of tape. And then this is just a little T and that'll be connected to the vacuum pump. You just stick each end in there. A little bit long, but that's all right. Actually, I think I might trim that. I want to keep these tubes as close to your mold as possible. I'm just going to tape the two molds together because we're going to do this all as one giant infusion. Makes it a little quicker. So now when you flip it over, you're left with the T here and then you have the spiral wrap going all the way around. I already cut out some peel ply which will be placed over the top. And that's pretty much your setup that's going to go in the bag. Might tape the corners just to hold everything in place. Nice part about resin infusion is all this can take as long as you want because you haven't introduced any resin yet. So you could spend hours doing this and it's no big deal. You don't have a time limit. So next I make a bag, put it in it, and We'll bag it.